will say let the root be or let one root be what alpha we said one of the roots of the equation is three times the other root so if one of the roots is alpha then the other root which is three times the initial one becomes three alpha so my root becomes alpha and three alpha three alpha because it's three times the other root all right so in this case now let's get sum and product of roots so sum of roots sum of roots is equal to sum these two i have alpha plus three alpha so that is equal to minus b all over a by the way for this equation here a is equal to this which is two b is equal to this which is k and c is equal to the constant which is f so if i have this now equal to minus b that's k all over a which is two so alpha plus three alpha gives four alpha so four alpha is equal to minus k all over two let's get the value of alpha i'll move four over here so it means that um, it means that alpha is now equal to if i move 